What is up, YouTube? Welcome to another Then and Now video. Please hit that like button. Please hit that subscribe button. Really helps out the channel, helps me to be able to grow the channel. So I just got back from the Greater Salt Lake area where it was still kind of wintry and we are finally getting some sun here in California. And uh, I went around to quite a few locations for Halloween 4. Anyone that's a horror fan at all has uh, a great affinity for the Halloween franchise. Of course, my favorite is Halloween 1. I really like Halloween 2, and I absolutely adore Halloween 3. I just wish it was not labeled Halloween 3 because it really has nothing to do with Michael Myers. And that brings us to Halloween 4 and what makes it so iconic. A couple of things for me. One, it's a 1980s Halloween film. So it's still in that decade where horror was on a tear. And uh, the second thing is, is that it was a return to the classic franchise kind of framework. Michael Myers is back, Dr. Loomis is back. Um, and so while the film really has its flaws, don't get me wrong, I, I think the film has its flaws, but it also has its high points. And um, it feels like a Halloween film for the most part. It has some cool scenes in it, some iconic locations, and really leveraged the Salt Lake area to feel very Halloween-ish. So without further ado, let's dive right into this one, and I hope you enjoy. Dr. Hoffman. I see. I see, thank you. Apparently, there was an accident just south of Mill Creek near the Br Loomis. Loomis! When did this happen? Sometime in the night. They probably lost the road in the storm, came down the embankment. It happened. An accident? Yes, sir. You believe that? Why should I? How many people in the bus? Four plus Myers. How many bodies did you find? It's hard to tell. They're all chewed up. Loomis. It's over. Leave it alone. He's gone. He was here, but he's gone. Did you find any other body? Not yet. There's a lot of ground to cover. You won't find him. He's done all this. Now he's escaped. You don't know that. Michael could have been thrown from the bus. I've seen bodies thrown 50, 60 feet from a crash site. And even if by some miracle Michael is conscious, his, his muscles will be totally useless. Give the troopers a chance to search. You're talking about him as if he were a human being. That part of him died years ago. Now where are you going? Haddonfield. It's a four-hour drive. You can reach me through the local police. If you don't find him in four hours, I'm sure I will.
Hey! Hey there! Hello! Why now? You waited ten years. I knew this day would come. Don't go to Haddonfield. You want another victim, take me. But leave those people in peace. Please, Michael. God damn you.
You remember Lindsay, don't you? Hi, Jean. Yeah. Hi. You ready for some ice cream? I want to go trick-or-treating, like the other kids. But I thought you didn't want to go trick-or-treating. You know, Rach, Discount Mart's having a sale on Halloween costumes. Rachel, Brady. just a second. Rachel, I, I got an explanation. Rachel, I... Hey, I got an explanation. Baby, you don't owe me anything, Rachel. Okay, come on, Rachel. Hold on a second. Just leave me alone and let's forget it. I just, I just got pissed off, that's all. Oh, really? Well, I'll just let you get back to little Miss Hot Panties. It's Rachel. Jamie. Brady. Are you coming in or what? Shit, Earl. It's Ted Hollister. You dumb son of a bitch. You said you saw Myers. Jamie! Get away! Don't touch him, Jamie! Tables. There's a <laughs> yeah. There's this guy. I don't know who the guy is. I think that guy's in the front of the picture or something. Yeah. I don't know who he is. But this is a really cool one because you can see the whole building. See how it says pennies? Yeah. 
Bless you. Oh. Look at that motorcycle rally or something, right? Yeah, oh, they, they had motorcycle runs here all the time. All the time. All the time. This is Toki. Toki owned it like right after Gertrude, probably. Toki? She owner? was a really awesome person. Yeah, she was an owner. And how, yeah. do you, if you remember offhand, how many owners have there been? Uh, there's like seven. I think it's only been seven hands. Look at this one. Look at the cars. Mm -hmm. Oh, wow. Another biker club. This is panties. Another one, panties. This is like this is like a picture of the whole entire property. When was it built? Oh, see, I look it. See, it was like a little office, the two doors, the restaurant, and then that little thing, and then the carport. Oh yeah. And right here is the oldest penny in the counter. Is right here is the 1893 Indian head penny, and these are all wheats. And then there's the four silvers and more wheats and more wheats. So it goes pink, pink. Tore off and broke and just damaged. There's two of them actually. But now it's just, it's just the one, huh? Now it's just this one that's left. And everything else is damaged. 